but no, the real uh, the real deal is uh, Brian and I started about four or five years ago. We started trying to get together and practice and play uh, cover songs, the songs that we really got. And, uh, and I came up with the name Strange Boys, and so we decided to you know, play out and play places, and we were doing the bass and drum act. And then Brian picked up the guitar, just did the RPM challenge, and did our crap for a while, which was phenomenal. Uh, very few people will have copies of it. It's a limited press. And uh, what we're trying to accomplish is to play songs in the late 70s, early 80s, to mid 80s, and sometimes late 80s, that cover a wide gamut of songs, songs that are diverse, songs that um, range everything from the Pretenders to Joe Jackson's early career, The Clash. We're trying to cover a lot of different songs, and, uh, and it's a lot of music that people don't get to listen to, and our generation don't get to listen to anymore unless they have CDs of it. We figured if we compile all these songs together and we play out, not only that, we're entertaining. I mean, we want to entertain people. People don't entertain anymore. They stand stoically behind a microphone and play, and, and nonetheless, uh, somehow they get paid. I don't know how we do that, so we want to change that. Uh, we want to play and open up for bands, and uh, we want to entertain people. We get people to sing with us on songs that they know, and uh, and really make an extravaganza out of it. So, uh, gig we got coming up is going to be really interesting in the global soul. And uh, I think that uh, anybody that comes to see us will not be let down at all. In fact, I think they'll have a really good time and, uh, and hopefully become long time fans of Strange Boy. Because we plan to be around for a long time. Uh, and we have quite the mission ahead of us, and I think it should be able to be accomplished now that we have the proper people the guitarist, Brian, and the drummer, Scotty. And uh, the bass playing fooled me uh, up there to make jokes and have fun. And, make light of uh, pop music and its uh, sad state of affairs with this, this now generation. So, thanks for listening to me. That's the whole Strange Boys story and I'm sticking to it. Hey, those videos going!